This new fashion trend's caught on with face masks. Everyone seems to be wearing face masks. Today, I'm gonna to show you some masks for the individualist. Because let's face it, no, you don't wanna look like everyone else. You just don't. So I'm gonna be showing you individualist masks for the concerning fashion conscious individual out there for who it's just unacceptable to look like everyone else, like me. So I'm gonna show you three masks for men, women, and dogs. Because, you know, your dogs are like your children. They're your loved ones and, you know, they're in your face and in your space all day long. <laughs> so you have to protect them and yourself from this uh, global pandemic virus stressful situation. So let's jump right in and have a look at the ladies' mask first. In fact, there's two variations of this mask and um, I'm sure you're gonna love it. Both men and women are gonna particularly love these masks. Um, for this, I'm gonna need my lovely wife to assist me. Hey, there's been this video going around about uh, scarves. <laughs> So that's very nice, but you still look like everyone else if you go outside. Um, yeah. So I'm going to show you a lovely one that you can do, especially for married couples. This is great. It works really well. So, so basically what you want to do is you want to take your wife's favorite scarf and then you could probably just fold it in any way you want. It doesn't really matter all that much. And then you just ask her to say, ah. Uh -huh. There we go. And then just make sure your dearest is comfortable. Um, don't, don't overdo it. There we go. How's that? Very good. Very, very comfortable. Very great. And then the nice thing about this is she can go outside and, and you know, um, it's, nice, it's nice and quiet in the house, which is added benefit. Um, and, uh, you know, it makes for a happy relationship. Very happy relationship. Great. The other one I'm going to show you is also uh, also a couple's one. This is um, so the problem with this scarf method is the scarf is still porous, so there's still a chance that you know air particles can pass through this. So it's it's really it's safe, but it's not that safe. So I've got another one. If you you know if you're concerned about the safety and the health of your wife, then this is a, a better one to use. So for this one you're gonna need some sports tape and uh, a knife, uh, scissors or knife. So I would never try something on my wife that, that I don't try on myself first. I'm not a cruel husband. And um, the other benefit of this method is that sometimes women have you know, a little bit of hair here, and a little bit of hair here, and, you know, that they tend to pluck out. Now this is gonna just as a added feature, added bonus, it's gonna take care of that problem for them. So let me show you how this works, this product of mine. So like I said, let's, let's first try this on ourselves. Then apply nice and firm pressure all the way through. Make sure you get it nice and tight. You don't want, you know, you don't want the mask coming off when they're out in the public. Um, there we go. You see, so, so nice adhesive, as you can see, nice health and safety first, very good. Um, and taking it off is, is definitely not painful at all. <laughs> so that wasn't so bad, as you can see. Let's try this on myself. So when applying this, you, you want to close your lips in. <laughs> <laughs> uh. 
As you can see, the, remember that little feature I told you about, about the removing excess unwanted hair growth? Um, as you can see, it does a sterling job at that. So the ladies will love this. They're going to absolutely love this. If you enjoyed this video, please subscribe and uh, ring that notification bell so you don't miss the next video. Thank you. Ciao. Thank you.